Hello everyone, for today's video I decided to film a lookbook as to what the students and people of UCI are wearing around campus, so let's check it out. Everyone's style was just so eclectic and it really shined through their accessories, like this guy had this cool like lighter necklace and it glistened in the sun so beautifully and it just looked so good with his very casual fit, the color block and whatnot. This next guy had a really beautiful story as to where he got his necklace from. It's from my father gave it to me. Uh, he, um, right now he has a like, cancer and everything. Oh, okay. So for my birthday he gave it to me. It's basically, he says, to my son, uh, never forget that I love you and I hope you believe in yourself as much as I believe in you. Love that. It's beautiful. So. Is that, does that say Ferragama? Yeah. Okay. Is that pronounced correctly? Yes. <laughs> I like the way you don't have your shoes tied. It's just very casual. It makes it very easy to put them on. I wanted to kind of go all black and then accent like the outfit with the white shoes. Mm -hmm. Like that was the first color that I saw in my closet, so I was like, why not make an outfit out of all black? Wearing all black will always be a classic, and this next person contrasted it by wearing some white and gold detailing throughout the outfit for a cool, windy, sporty look. And this next person found a pretty cool way to style their laces and sweater together. I was like, you know what, I should probably, you know, wear something that correlates, <laughs> at least semi. Yeah, so, the laces are literally like identical to yeah. what the sh what's on the shoes. Thank you. Well, so I usually don't even get my nails done regularly. Usually I do it myself. Uh -huh. um, but the opportunity came up, someone to do it for free, and that's nice. Oh, that's sick. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and then the baby blue, it's mm -hmm. just... Oh. There really are no rules to fashion. If you want to wear something and you wear it with confidence, you'll rock it. Things may look funky at first, but that's the fun thing about trying things on. They don't have to match, they don't have to correlate, and sometimes that can make a pretty strong look. It's from an uh, Italian brand. I don't know its name, but it's very expensive. <laughs> <laughs> the shirt is from, uh, called Alexandro Rich, and this is come from Common Best Grackles. No. Yes, it is. It's gorgeous. <laughs> it's and like, the shirt's from Clarks. From Clarks. Yeah. I saw the logo. It's that like raw leather like kind of quality. <laughs> Getting like kind of like pirate going to the fashion show at the end of the day. <laughs> yes. Like sent, like ship at 3 o'clock, fashion show at 6 o'clock. <laughs> I wish it too. I want to go to Fashion Quake. <laughs> I actually really want to do this like you because I think last quarter I, I, I was preparing for the for the like prepare the shooting for others people dressing and oh really other. yeah yeah I really want to really curious and really passionate for this I want to be a stylist when I graduate I mean I see it all yeah. you you've got the guts and you good. too I like oh, your nails you. oh my god so cute <laughs> uh, this is me mm. okay yeah. how did you inspire yourself to do your makeup today uh, cause I do it every day so I use a hard line to strong my eyes. Yeah, yeah it looks like good. That, yeah. Something a, like Kai. Yeah, you look like this from a distance. Like, yeah. Don't mess with me. <laughs> initially stopped her because her pants and her hair were flowing beautifully in the wind. It's like as if the wind was embracing her and it really helped complement the whole look. How long do those last for you? I get a fill like every three weeks. I haven't ha not had nails for maybe like the last like four years of my life. I love that. Yeah. I wish I could it's do that. It's a part of me. <laughs> I was a receptionist at a nail salon for two years, so I had to. Oh, okay. And then if, from then I was like, all right, well, I'm not going to take them off. <laughs> this is from Misguided. It's part of oh, Misguided? I love Misguided. My, my social media is just at M-G-H-A-P-A-N on like all platforms. Okay. You can follow me. I'm really funny on Twitter. <laughs> If you look at like a kabuki makeup, it's like that like uh, dramatic like flare under the eye. Uh -huh. Like that's what I really love about it. Ooh. Yeah. This is a band. It's called Bilch. It's like a hardcore band. Like uh. put up like the Sanrio characters and like they sold it like uh. a lot. Yeah. Oh, yeah. If you have an Instagram, I don't know if you'd like to share that. Oh. Makeup is so unique and special to everyone, so I really appreciate it when people take the time in the morning to get up and really showcase their artistry to the world. Did you dye your own hair? Or yeah. You do? I dye okay, my hair. Okay, I was like, 
That, that looks like manic panic right there. <laughs> Is it manic panic? Yeah. <laughs> I have an Instagram. Okay. It's at Kiara Official. Doing the smallest things, like notice how this guy rolled up his sleeves, can really help polish your whole entire outfit. Trying to break with me. Yeah, right now? I mean, woo, are you walking like to and from class right now? Basically all day, yeah. I mean, that's the way to do it. Yeah. <laughs> Once you get them beat up, they'll be like your babies. Where can people find you? Instagram, at jadethejedi. What I really like about monochromatic outfits is that you can really dress them up or down however you'd like. There's so much contrast within what this person's wearing that it really helps tie in the whole silhouette. Check out their tats. Another monochromatic look that was stylized with a beautiful hairpin, a belt, and a little Chanel moment. I usually don't wear this. I usually don't go as gaudy as this. Uh, I like my... that way. Uh, you've caught me on a weird day. We were, we were like purposely dressing like extra e boy today. Right here, that's exactly what it's going Except for. Except for my socks, they're like theirs. Now, this girl was accessorizing her leather in all the right ways and tying it all together with the stripes and, of course, the accessories. Hey, where did you get that beanie from? This is actually from Bricks and Wood. It's a uh, South Central LA based company. I'm trying to grow my hair out so it's kind of in the awkward phase. Oh, so is that I, what you're I, doing? I, yeah, I just, I've just been wearing hats like every day. I stopped this next guy to chat with him just because he looked like such a student with a copy in his hand. Looked like he was waiting for class or something and just seemed like he had a really positive attitude about his day. Tortured Artist Club? <laughs> yes. Kind of everything. They're a mix of places like either Etsy or Did just like my boyfriend has got them. I did iron on and then my mom has a sewing machine so she like made sure they're not okay. gonna go anywhere. No, but like you put them on, right? Oh yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, I mean they all, it looks like it looks professional. And then you have some pins over here? Yeah I have. I would see these ones. Little fish. You have patches have, on the bad pack too. I have pins and patches everywhere. You're decked out right here. I'm just a walking billboard. <laughs> You're walking billboard. I love it though. I like, like very artsy stuff. Yeah. Like, you know. yeah. I mean, it definitely shows. It's like you can tell you put time and effort Thank into you. this. You, you are like living in a mountain of flowers right now. Oh, okay. Yes. In like a we green went. grass field. <laughs> oh, there's a bird on the back. Yeah. Oh, yes. Bird? Yeah. There's a butt. There's a butt? Yeah, it's a corgi butt. Oh. <laughs> I was like, your butt? What? Nope. It's a corgi butt. <laughs> My Instagram is hyperpeach, but instead of the E on hyper, it's an X. That's a torture from Kim Petras? Yes, Kim Petras, Dickies, Thirsted Jacket, Jeans, and Doc Martin. Let me see your book. From Urban Outfitters. Urban Outfitters. <laughs> you can follow me, Manny T, M M A N N Y T. Okay. Dainty pops of color here really work with the beautiful lilacs on top and the dark, shiny burgundies on the bottom. I always match. I love matching my eyeliner with like with accessories. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yesterday I had actually a red eyeliner with a red necklace and my nails. It was different shades uh. of red. I love doing that. You can follow me on Twitter. I'm stubborn Arab. If you want things about if politics. These girls had such a bright and bubbly personality and they really brought light into my day when I stopped to talk to them. So I really appreciate that. Okay, great. Yeah. I sell clothes on Depop. My username is at Julie Daughters. Daughters spelled like D A U G H T E R S. Now, this girl had a very clean silhouette, but the thing that kept her going was that bed hair. She was rocking that bed hair, and it really made her look like very rare. Loves it. My, my artist name is Avacar. A V A C A R with two underscores. I'm a singer, so there you go. Now this girl can be spotted from miles away rocking her cheetah print. Where did you find these? These are from Urban. Uh, um, it's Ash Wizzle, so it's A-S-H-W-I-Z-L-E, just one Z. I match my scrunchies to my outfit every day. Oh. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, it's my mom's top from college, actually. So like most of my stuff is hers from college. Because no <laughs> she has fashion. So like I was like, hey, might as well uh -huh. take it. If people want to follow it, I have an Instagram. It's <laughs> at A-Y-L-E-X-X underscore it's Alex. Okay. So that's about it.
Now, with the bag, the shorts, and the combat boots, this girl was giving me major Laura Croft vibes. My yeah, nails like are like kind of messed up. No, they look good. They're my like dog nice, broke like pink. a bunch of my nails. The glasses are, are classic Ray Bans. Yeah, classic Ray Bans. And where'd you get your bag? Oh, it's Gucci, so I got it <laughs> from Vegas. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it's on, it's at the B underscore Native underscore Loader. Okay. I feel like it's once in a blue moon that you stumble upon someone's fashion who is just so carefree and such a rule breaker in the best ways possible. Like, this person's outfit was just such a breath of fresh air. Battle Bolt. Battle Bolt? Yeah. What is that? It's like the soldiers, when you fight, they wear those kind of shoes. Oh, yeah, yeah I look, see it. It pretty much looks like that. And I had an Instagram. Is there Just anything if anyone wants to see like what you're let's see. My account is pretty much food. I mean everyone has their like <laughs> Oh what's on the shoes right there? Uh it's a Brain Dead and Vans collab. Uh, is that like a band or Brain Dead is uh streetwear. Right? Streetwear? Oh yeah. okay. I try to have like a what's it called? Like my wardrobe is just I try to have it just like synergetic, where like if I just choose random stuff, it'll match. It, well, it's yeah. like a reddish, like this, it matches everything. Like it accents the red here. Yeah. And then a little bit of red in here. And then there's that little like bit that you can see of the graphic from the shirt. Oh wow, the colors are like shining right there. Thank you. What I you actually do, um, I do music and photography. My Instagram is Christopher Kaiju. C-H-I-S-T-O-P-H-E-R-K-A-I-J-U. This woman had a lot of patterns, and in the wind, they looked breathtaking, as well as a lot of purple dainty details, which I really appreciated. I got this top when I was in Madrid. Oh, okay. Yeah, I got it at like a El Corte Inglés outlet. Wearing. These are Doc Martens. Do you, do you mind pulling Chelsea up the style. special Some socks? Little, socks. <laughs> little palm trees, neon palm trees. Yes. I also got this bag at a museum. I like it because it's cute and simple. Yeah, it makes you look very official. It's like very um, office job at 3 o'clock and caballero dance at 7 p.m. Line dancing at, Line dancing 7, at 7 p.m. PM. <laughs> Thank you. I got these earrings at a place called Los Callejones. They had a lot of really sparkly things in the store. Can I like move them around a little Yeah, bit? go ahead. Wow, you can turn them upside down. You can turn gorgeous. this down. Yeah, I like that. So they're hanging. Lastly, do you have like any social medias or anything you'd want to share for anyone interested? Um, like an Instagram or something? Sure, you can follow me on Instagram. It's jo.cy. Just like that, jo. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. Talk about knowing your history. <laughs> this next woman had a lot of cool insight as to where her pieces were from. This, everything is always used, honestly. I, I mostly go to cross, uh, Crossroads and okay. Buffalo Cuisine, so inspired by like 90s riot girl fashion, hence yeah. like the short hair. Like brown mascara, is that like a different color oh, mascara? Oh yeah, it's, it's burgundy mascara actually. I saw that. Nice. It yeah. like hits the light and it's like, it's, it's very like, what is it called? <laughs> These are actually antique Chinese coins. This is an ancient Roman ring. It's a stamp. Oh. When you were to seal letters in wax, you would have like an embossed convex image. Uh -huh. So yeah, it's an ancient bronze ring. <laughs> this is from the turn of the century. Um, I think it's I think it's Turkish or something. So people used to wear them like dancing because it like, oh, it does make kind of noise. Yeah. yeah. My Instagram is Zigfield Follies. Again, it's like a weird history nerd thing. Loving the difference of styles from one crossbody bag to another. What was your name? Faith. Faith? Yeah. Like Faith? Like Jesus, yeah. Oh, nice to meet you, Faith. <laughs> nice my name's Regino. Are those are your glasses? Yeah, these are my yeah. glasses. And Prescription. Then, yeah. <laughs> my bag, OMG, okay, honestly, college budget, so Amazon. No, honestly, that was like... But, you know, here it is. <laughs> What the 
is that a jumpsuit? Yeah, it is a jumpsuit. My mom actually got it made. Well, so yeah, I got it made in Nigeria. Mm -hmm. um, so it's like it's a one of a one of a kind. <laughs> but um, yeah, I really like it because it's also like Black History Month. So like I wanted to wear the pieces that she got me this month. But I'm also gonna like incorporate them in general. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm here. Your for necklace it. is like shining right now. Look at these shoes. Where did you get the info to do your eyeshadow? Is that a cross? I got it. It is a cross. It, there's two different ones. There's a I think this one's black and this one's blue. Um, I got the inspiration from Instagram, which I usually do. My lipstick is actually, I think I have it in my pocket. It's this Winky Lux one, right? And the color mermaid, I think, and it's really pretty. And then your hair is like yellow, goes very good with purple. Exactly, and yes. Do you mind if I get like a little like spin around? Okay. Oh, spin around? Okay. Oh, it's blue backpack. It is a blue backpack. I love blue. I have like my Twitter and my Instagram are the same thing. They're both just you can, okay. 829. This is actually <laughs> every day. I know, always showing out. Okay, that's that's what this runway was made for. Ring Road is literally a runway. It really no, is. It's a cakewalk. <laughs> yes. Every day. I got this top um, online at some store. I don't remember mm -hmm. the name. These are just from like Pretty Little Thing, I think. Oh. Oh, the biker Shemma's shorts like in there Thank and then your you. shoes are also oh my <gasps> Thank you. Oh, oh wait, wait, wait. I have to get that. Yeah, I have to get that. <laughs> Honestly, it's from the beauty supply store. Really? Yeah. Do you wanna like tilt your feet to the oh, this way? Oh, good. <laughs> there you go. Sorry, yeah. Really good. Well one's kinda stuck. Or is it ripped off? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Wait, wait, let's <laughs> let's turn now. Let's turn let's turn size. Let's turn size. Let's turn. <laughs> And then your lashes are like, oh, thank they you. are like, I'm like about to flutter right now. <laughs> you wink and I'm about to Don't like, whoa. <laughs> 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 yes, yeah, you know, the bigger the better for lashes, always, period. I have um, just oh, some it's hair wow. rings and oh, Actually, I, <laughs> I write poetry. So I have a poetry page um, on Instagram, so it's at pretty.lilbirds. Thank you so much. Yeah, this is actually Led Zeppelin. Um, I got it at Cotton On because I used to work there. And where did um, you get your jewelry? I got this at H&M. Actually, all my jewelry is from H&M. I got the rings. Uh, they came in a set for five bucks. So like, H &M? a score, honestly. Where are you going? I know, H&M. <laughs> get in bitch right. H &M. <laughs> I had these for like six months and they already look like this, so. Um, like, yeah. the more wear, the better. The I more wear, the better, to be honest. And it kind of matches your, or it does, the color's yeah, like the same kind of like green tone. Kind of, a little bit. Videos or anything like that? Yeah, so I on Instagram, um, at Josh Rao, Josh, M-U-R-A-O. If you put fashion, plush, and cozy together, you would get this. See? I think it's cute. Yeah, it is really cute, because it's yeah. all, is that a button? Yeah, it's a oh button. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I like this so much. It's like I wear it like every day or like five times a week. I don't think I've ever seen anyone wear a button earring, so those <laughs> are marvelous. Here's another way someone styled their cream turtleneck. Cuteness overload. <laughs> and then what about your sweater? Um, I it's got gorgeous. this from Garage, actually. Garage? Yeah. Have you had it for a while? It looks like it's like been like loved. Um, actually, I just got this yesterday. Oh my god. <laughs> So apart from also wearing a cream turtleneck, this next guy actually had his own clothing line. Here it is, you guys can check him out at Acrylic Matter. I got a fashion clothing line. A clothing line? Yeah, this is mine though. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, it's more like a uh, artwear, streetwear brand. You can check this out. Okay, thank you so much. I got this sweater from ASOS and this denim jacket. It's actually my girlfriend's. <laughs> uh, I like I'm, I'm not sure where she got it from. These are just corduroy pants from Urban Outfitters. Oh, I didn't even notice like the shoes are cream as well. I thought yeah. they were white, so it's like all cream right there. Yeah. And it all ties in together with the baby blue. It's very like baby vibe. Yeah. Right? <laughs> I don't know if you had any social medias or anything you'd want to show. Oh, the card, right? Uh, the card, and um, I'm also I also make music. Uh, I am swim underscore. You need to follow me in there. Um, I actually have a project being released February awesome. 29th. Check it out, everyone. <laughs> this girl was giving me major Bratz dolls vibes from the skirt to the beret. So cute. P A M E L A dot A N N E E. The pops of pink this guy was wearing definitely made him stand out from the crowd.
This sweater actually, my friend made it. So. Oh, it's like wait. Oh, it says something. I need yeah, to it, is, it says Little Lips. That's his like brand name, I guess. Okay. Um, yeah. You want to follow him at Little Lip? Yeah, it's just like he makes like stickers and all. Nothing too crazy. Oh, so you have this? That's a. Yeah, th this is a sticker oh, for Little Lips. A supporter. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> like he's a high school friend, so it's like oh. I have to show support. You know, yeah. it's like he's a cool guy. This is okay, it. I got it. This girl was serving us major 80s vibes from the high ponytail to the acid wash of her shoes and the triangle neon graphic on her sweatshirt. These two friends looked so cute together with their pastel colors, the pink, the yellows, the baby blues, the baby greens, loves it. It was actually raining this day, and this girl was wearing a yellow standout bucket hat that looked so cute paired with her orange bag. Two words, simple and effective. What's that? This is Amor Fati, Latin for lover of one's fate. And this one is French, sans femme, for um, without fear. This is the rose that grew from concrete. <laughs> It's a what? The rose that grew from concrete when no one else cared. Oh. You can follow me on Instagram at Kyla L. Cheney. What a perfect way to wear a color block with yellow, blue, and red. My YouTube is at, ooh, what is it? It's at Burial. It's right here. Yes, it's this. At Burial. Okay. And this is my, also my Instagram. Okay, yeah. They can find you right there. Yes. Now this woman looked fabulous from head to toe. Check out how she paired the stripes in her hat and her vest. And I think we can all agree that purple is definitely her color. I guess this is like a compilation of like just different things I just have. One laying around the house, but also like been thinking about as well. You know, I have this like idea just like I guess pertaining like the earlier night, I, you know, okay, but it'd be really cool to see how that works and if it works, I just walk out with it. it was, most of us like develop, like I got these shoes for like, what is it, uh, a concert and... They're from a concert? Yeah, they're, they're from uh, the Camp Fognall concert. Oh, yeah. oh, I see the flower right mm -hmm. there. So I usually like wearing those and then the rest of the stuff I got like on a traveling trip. Yeah. All of it? Uh, the jacket, scarf, yeah. It's Where'd you get the scarf? That's like a very playful Ooh. scarf. Uh, I got it at a Beatles memorabilia store. Oh! Yeah. Oh, so, so it's like it has like a pattern like, from an album? Or yeah, it's like, like Beatles The Universe, I, I believe. I got it at their memorabilia store when I was out there. It's from like, I don't even remember what the store is called. It was like <laughs> somewhere in the backtracks of London. Like, I walked. Abbey Road and I went and got this after so I was like oh, oh in I London really, yeah like, oh. or it's like the Beatles the universe oh okay it's like one of their scarves well I'm a dancer my uh, my name is uh, Killer B as a dancer I'm a freestyle dancer so I would go to different places in Los Angeles and um, Riverside and just dance freestyle dance I also do choreography dance um any like social medias or anything you'd be comfortable with sharing uh yeah or, um okay. let me see uh just at Killer B for Instagram I think at killer B just spelled yeah. killer and then B? Yes, just okay. capital B, Killer B uh, on Instagram. Um, yeah, that would probably be it. Save me for Twitter. Okay, okay. awesome. Thank you so much. Well, that was it. I hope you enjoyed this time capsule of what people are wearing at UC Irvine right now. Again, I just want to give a special loving thank you to every single person that helped participate in this. You all were so lovely and never forget that a smile really is your best accessory.